Say goodbye to plastic bags if you shop in Boston because the city just voted to ban them. This ban impacts stores, restaurants, pharmacies as well in Boston. And if Mayor Walsh approves it, it will take effect within a year. All in favor say aye. Aye. Any opposed say nay. And that was it, a resounding 10-0 vote by the Boston City Council to ban those thin, single-use plastic shopping bags. Madam President, we have a unanimous vote for Dr. Number Two. The ban's goal is to dramatically reduce the use of plastic bags by encouraging people to bring their own bags to stores or pay a nickel for a paper bag or a thicker reusable plastic bag. Charge Great idea. They polluted the oceans, pollutes everything. I know it's hard for people at first, but everyone, we all get used to it. City Councilor Matt O'Malley spearheaded the ban. They end up in our streets, in our storm gutters, uh, in our trees, tangled in our wildlife and our marine ecosystem. Some businesses, though, oppose this ban, even calling charging for bags a tax. In a statement, an industry lobbying group says it's a shame that city councilors push through a tax that will hit seniors and low-income families the hardest. We hope Mayor Walsh will reject this new measure. The people backing the ban are ecstatic. Once we won in Boston, then the state will follow immediately, we're sure. So we're, we're so thrilled to finally see this come to pass. We can help clean it up, and we can have an incredibly positive impact, not only on the environment, uh, but on reducing litter and, and really increasing the quality of life for all Bostonians. Now, Mayor Walsh's office says he's reviewing this bill right now, the ordinance, and if he signs it, Boston would become the 16th community in the state to ban plastic bags. They're obviously terrible for the environment. Right? And I have seen some stores now, they have what, it looks like a plastic bag, but it's a sort of biodegradable material. Right, and reusable. Which is kind of nice, and reusable as well. Exactly.